Time is running out. It's so easy to feel like your life is just going to go on forever, but the reality is your time is limited. If you're college age, you have maybe 2,900 weekends left to live, and that's all, and then your life will be over. My dad passed away from pancreatic cancer over 10 years ago. I can hardly believe it's been that long. One thing I remember him saying after he found out that he had pancreatic cancer was that in a way we all have a terminal disease. We all, guaranteed, all of us are going to pass away and our life here is going to be done. Why death then? Why is everything the way that it is? Well, the Bible says that the wages of sin is death. Because of sin, death has entered into the world and things are messed up. They're not the way they should be. But the good news is there is hope. Jesus came and bore that judgment that should have fallen on us. Therefore, there's hope. He overcame the grave and he ever lives to intercede for his people. The Bible says that if you repent and believe in Jesus, you can be forgiven for your sins. Because of Jesus, because my sins are paid for, I'm not afraid of death. I look forward to dying and being with the Lord, being with my Savior forever. There's peace because I know my sins are taken care of in Jesus Christ. It's not because of me trying to earn something or work my way to heaven, but Jesus paid it all, and therefore, there's no fear of death. You can have assurance and know where you're going when you die. So time is running out, but you don't have to live in fear of death, in fear of your life coming to an end. You can have peace and joy in Christ. So turn to Christ, trust in Him, give Him your all. The Bible talks about taking up your cross daily and following Him. That's, that's death to self and all to Christ. Turn to Christ, follow Him, find life and peace and rest and joy in the Savior.